My name is Robin Frohart and I'm the creator of the Plastic Bag Store. The Plastic Bag Store looks like a regular grocery store and it's full of items that seem very familiar. There are like humorous and satirical takes on sort of everyday products that highlight the amount of waste that we're using and the environmental problems related. Because the Plastic Bag Store feels like a regular grocery store, I think the next time you go to a grocery store it might feel like the Plastic Bag Store and that might make you think a little bit about what's happening to the planet and the packaging situation. There's an excessive amount of waste and single-use plastic that's used daily in New York City and all over the world. Um, and it's designed for convenience, designed to be used for a very brief period of time and then thrown away. Uh, but there is no away and it doesn't go anywhere, it doesn't decompose, and it's ending up in our oceans and in the environment and it's a real problem. I'm Jean Cooney, director of Times Square Arts. It just holds that mirror up to all of the plastics that are part of our everyday experiences and everyday retail experiences in particular that we just don't see. And one of the things I love about this project is that without presenting the facts and figures, it still is something that stays with you. You almost can't unsee the plastic bag store when you step into your next grocery store experience. We originally had planned the project to coincide with the New York State plastic bag ban that went into effect March 1st of 2020. But much like the project, the ban was also put on pause during the pandemic. It's now being reinstated around the exact same time that we had the opportunity to present the work. So a poetic coincidence, um, but by no means the predetermined plan. The project opens October 22nd, only days after that New York State plastic bag ban is reinstated. And it's open for three weeks. It's a pretty limited run. Um, it's Wednesdays through Saturdays and people can experience the project in small groups in hour-long intervals that will incorporate both the ability to browse the store and experience the film installation.